has been shown to produce alpha brainwaves within 30 minutes of consumption, which is a relaxed, alert state, ideal for getting into a state of focus and flow and managing anxiety. Nootropics or smart drugs are compounds or supplements that enhance cognitive performance and can be derived from either natural or synthetic substances. They're used to enhance memory, focus and other cognitive functions, but can they actually make you smarter? You will have seen everyone from Dave Asprey, Joe Rogan to Ben Greenfield pushing their own brands. But you probably didn't know that there are four important things you need to know before you take nootropics. Thankfully, I've got a free download that covers them in detail for you. But first, let's take a look at why people take them, how they work, then the big one. Do nootropics actually make you smarter? A survey of over 50,000 people internationally we conducted when researching my book Unstoppable found that there are four main reasons people take nootropics. One, they're suffering from depression and want to improve their mood. Two, they're having trouble focusing during the day. Three, they're struggling with poor memory and brain fog. And four, they're underperforming and want to increase their energy and mental alertness, especially when it comes to boosting their productivity. Which is why you'll see entrepreneurs and Silicon Valley elites flock to nootropics in droves. But here's something that may surprise you. Nootropics are already a part of your daily life. For example, you've already ingested at some time a nootropic or a nootropic stack. The most common, caffeine the world's most popular psychoactive substance and nootropic. However, caffeine is a double-edged sword. While studies have shown that it can improve mental performance and alertness, studies have also shown that caffeine can induce anxiety for two reasons. One, it interferes with adenosine, a brain chemical that has a calming effect. And two, it raises levels of lactate in the brain, a biochemical implicated in panic attacks. If you've ever had black tea, you've had a nootropic stack as it contains both caffeine and L-theanine, which is an amino acid. L-theanine has been shown to produce alpha brainwaves within 30 minutes of consumption, which is a relaxed, alert state, ideal for getting into a state of focus and flow and managing anxiety. It's what I took when I wrote Unstoppable, a 90,000 word book that covers biohacking and nootropics in detail. What was this? A drug for people who wanted to be more anal retentive. I wasn't high, wasn't wired, just clear. I knew what I needed to do and how to do it. When L-theanine is combined with caffeine, it balances the anxiety producing effects of the caffeine. So you get an increase of energy without the added anxiety. So how do nootropics work? The influence of nootropics in the brain has been widely studied and can enhance your brain's performance through a number of pathways or mechanisms. For example, the dopaminergic pathway. Research has also demonstrated that nootropics boost brain function while making the brain healthier. Other ways they work include acting as a vasodilator against the small arteries in the brain. This can increase the blood circulation to the brain while providing key nutrients and increase blood flow and energy to the brain. They also support brain energy by enhancing metabolic activity of the mitochondria, which is the powerhouse of brain and other cells. And the next part is incredibly important. Nootropics may also optimize neurotransmitters by supplying brain chemical precursors so they can be created, specifically dopamine and serotonin. Serotonin is our feel-good neurotransmitter, while dopamine is in charge of motivation, reinforcement and reward. Aside from caffeine and L-theanine, other popular nootropics include creatine, which is an amino acid that once consumed, enters your brain to bind with phosphate, creating a molecule that your brain uses to quickly fuel its cells. Bacopa, an ancient herb studied to show that it can speed up information processing in your brain, reduce reaction time, and improve memory. And Rhodiola rosea, an adaptogenic herb that's been shown to improve mood and decrease feelings of burnout in both anxious and highly stressed individuals. We then have more serious nootropics like nicotine, which is naturally occurring in many plants like tobacco, but it's also highly addictive. Nicotine has been shown to improve alertness and attention in people with naturally poor attention spans. We then have synthetic smart drugs like Nupeps, Paracetam and Modafinil. But before you dive into any, either natural or synthetic, 
Make sure you download the free guide below for my book Unstoppable so you know what to be aware of before you take a nootropic. Now, the big question, do nootropics actually make you smarter? This is where we need to understand what intelligence actually is. Intelligence isn't a predetermined trait. It's a changeable, flexible ability to learn and stimulate your brain that can improve over time. There are two types. Crystallized intelligence, which is your vocabulary, knowledge and skills, and fluid intelligence, which is fluid reasoning and your ability to reason and think abstractly. The bottom line is a pill cannot divulge wisdom or make everyone capable of brilliance, but they can tune up your machinery, especially if you're experiencing nutritional deficiencies, which many of us are due to stress and lifestyle factors. Think of nootropics like a lens wipe that clears away debris and smudges that prevent you from seeing through your glasses. When you see clearly, you can make faster, more concise decisions. You can increase speed, learning, memory and efficiency because your vision is clear. You can focus longer because roadblocks like slow brain function and brain fog have been cleared from your path. I've taken nootropics for the past five years and in the last three years, I've written three books totaling over 250,000 words and went from broke to doing over $2.3 million in sales. That was only possible because I cleared the bloatware in the background of my brain and focused on improving my cognitive performance after experiencing severe depression. Nootropics were a key step in several that I took that didn't just change my life, it saved it. Here's what I want you to remember. Nootropics help you to unlock your capacity to achieve, but you need to understand what to look for and be aware of first. Download your free guide below so you can understand the four things that you need to know before you take them.